from the studios of Ditchbow Media, I'm Ben Bowdage, and this is Saturday Night at the Movies. Saturday Night at the Movies, who cares what picture you see? When you're hugging with your baby, let's roll in the bathroom. I guess that a Hollywood and the popcorn from the candy stand makes it all seem twice as good. There's always lots of pretty girls with figures they don't try to hide, but they never can compare to the girl sitting by my side. Saturday night at the movies. Welcome along to Saturday Night at the Movies. Tonight's film is set during the American Civil War. Now this was a war fought between the northern states, known as the Union, which was the federal government of President Lincoln, and the southern states, known as the Confederate States, or the Confederacy. The Civil War began in 1861, primarily as a result of the long-standing controversy over the enslavement of black people. The Loyalists of the Union proclaimed support for the Constitution and human rights of black people, whilst the Southern states advocated to uphold the slavery of black people. A Union Cavalry Brigade led by Colonel John Marlowe, played by John Wayne, a railroad construction engineer in civilian life, is sent on a raid into enemy territory behind Confederate lines to destroy a railroad and supply depot at Newton Station. The film tonight is loosely based around the actual events of the Battle of Newton Station on April 24, 1863, where the film also stars William Holden, who plays Major Henry Kendall, who is the brigade's doctor. Released in 1959 and directed by John Ford, Saturday Night at the Movies presents John Wayne in this adventure war western, The Horse Soldiers. We are a band of brothers, and to the sword. Fighting for our liberty with friends of blood and joy. Make way for the new screen adventure from four-time Academy Award winner John Ford, The Horse Soldiers. Make way for the screen's two top stars in their most outstanding roles. John Wayne and William Holden, riding hell-bent for glory in the most daring adventure that ever thundered across the screen. Make way for a rousing adventure story that relives history's most daring give em hell raid and the two hellions who rode side by side to lead it. for the horse soldiers. This is Saturday Night at the Movies and I hope you enjoyed tonight's 1959 film The Horse Soldiers. Did you know that Holden and Wayne both received $750,000 for their roles in the film, which was a record salary at the time? During filming of the climatic battle scene, veteran stuntman Fred Kennedy suffered a broken neck while performing a horse fall and he died. And director John Ford, he was absolutely 
completely devastated. John Wayne's fictional character as Colonel Marlowe was actually based around Colonel Benjamin Greeson, who was actually a music teacher before joining the army that led the 1700 soldiers through several hundred miles of enemy territory, destroying Confederate railroad and supply lines, which became known in history as Greeson's Raid. Another John Wayne classic from 1955 is coming your way here at the movies. He's a sneak peek. Time, the present. Place, China. The village of Chikushan on the East China Sea. 180 people live here, held together by the bond of a single dream. We ask you to guide us through Formosa Strait to freedom. 300 miles down Blood Alley. Sweet bit of grand larceny. A whole village scratched off the red map and put down in Hong Kong. Look forward to that one. Have yourself a great night and I will catch you next time at the movies. Good night.